what are the causes of primary hyperparathyroidism, parathyroid adenoma, and parathyroid cancer? I'm Dr. Bob Akhmaryam from Center for Advanced Parathyroid Surgery. Well, all parathyroid diseases are caused by mutations in our genetic code, right? So we know that radiation exposure is one of the causes of developing hyperparathyroidism and potentially parathyroid cancer. So radiation causes mutations in genes, right? That can lead to that. Now, if there's <clears throat> genes that run in families, right, that cause hyperparathyroidism, like the MEN syndromes, there's a gene called CDC73 that can not only cause parathyroid adenomas and hyperplasia, but it can also cause parathyroid cancer. So there's a genetic base to it that can run in families. Um, but I would say majority of patients that I have don't have a family history of parathyroid disease and don't have radiation exposure, right? So there must be more to this story. There probably is stuff in our environment that causes mutations. And if that mutation happens in the parathyroid, in the specific gene in the, in the parathyroid uh, cells, then that can turn into a tumor or very rarely cancer. If you're interested in clear parathyroid information, visit us at parathyroid.net.